my new bitch look like Tyler Perry. But she don't love me, she too scary. My old bitch fun, I don't wanna know if she too down. Who you is my leading lady? I wanna hunt you down. Welcome back to my channel. If you are a new subscriber, my name is Mangi Lenyati. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back for yet another video. Uh, hi. Say hi to my friends. Say hi. Say hi. Hi, friends. Hi, friends. What are we doing today? Today is just another vlog. Tell your friends. Yes, today is just another vlog. <laughs> we just finished. Um, getting ready not necessarily getting ready but we just finished um we took a bath together um look cute and then we are just about to take some pictures it is today's a sunday and the time is i'm gonna have to check it is half past three it is a sunday it's half past three the date is the 24th tomorrow's payday it's been a long weekend very long for me it actually started on thursday um and then today is sunday we didn't do anything much from thursday up till saturday actually today too i was just at home with my son because he wasn't feeling too well how are you feeling now how are you feeling hi high five high five yay yeah so he wasn't feeling too good so i had to make sure that you know i nurse him at home make sure that he, he has everything that he needs in order to feel better because he has to go to crash tomorrow he was actually sent back uh, from crash on was it wednesday or the on wednesday because thursday was a holiday really so he was sent back home on wednesday um they phoned us and they were like no he's not doing too good if one of you could just come fetch him and then his dad was closer to um the crash than i was uh, so he actually went back and then went home with him so yeah he's still not feeling that good but he's definitely getting there like he's just coughing and he wasn't eating too but he's doing much better now he's eating just certain food Ooh. hi yes now he is doing much better he's playing as well guys my son was just sitting there doing nothing nothing i was so worried but he's doing much better so welcome to another vlog we're just gonna take pictures today and then just wait because there's nothing we can do we can't even go out because tomorrow's payday and the day before payday is like the worst day because that's when everything runs out guys i don't know if it's just me but the day before payday okay so i don't know if it's just me but the day before payday is like the worst one that's when everything decides to just run out food everything and and your stuff is the most expensive by the way <laughs> so yeah guys um if you haven't subscribed and you're watching please do subscribe share you guys know what to do um and yeah let's just see what happens today we're just going to take pictures with Landy for instagram because i feel like my instagram is so dry right now i haven't taken pictures in a long time do a little bit of makeup just a little bit a little bit and then i have this dress on i'm going to show you guys the full dress it's just a black dress that i got from somewhere chinatown i think chinatown eh? was it chinatown my babes right yeah yeah that's where i got my dress <laughs> do you like it <laughs> and don't take it off this boy this boy <laughs> taking 
pictures as you can see i'm not looking like a para the sun is too much i'm just gonna oh. hey guys so what's going on i'm lighting too much here mm -hmm. So we just finished taking pictures. As you guys can see, I'm now looking like a para. My hair is bad, that's why I have this on. We actually just got back from from the shops. We went to buy. What's happening with this camera? What's wrong with this camera now? Yeah, what's happening? We just <laughs> come. We just got back from the shops. We went to buy mohodu and pap because we feel like mkhodu and I wasn't about to start cooking that thing from scratch eh? so we went to go buy it instead yeah that place has the best mkhodu guys yo it's got the best right that place has the best mkhodu so yeah that was this guys this boy's favorite part of the day is going out taking a walk or going to the shops just being outside the house in here. he just wants to be outside the house for some reason I think he gets bored in here my camera keeps moving <laughs> but yeah so we are about to we're not gonna eat now i think this guy is he wants to take a nap now <coughs> sorry baby oh, it's his nap time so i'm gonna make his bottle and then put him to sleep nap nap then i'm just gonna chill and watch maybe some vlogs or something Day. I just got back from work. Actually, not just got back. I think I, I got home about 30 minutes ago. I had to go to daycare first to pick up my son. So yeah, it is a Tuesday, and just want to check in with you guys. See how you guys are doing. Fill you guys in on what's happening or what has been happening since the last time we spoke. So yeah, my son is sleeping right now, and um, guys, he's still not feeling well. I don't know what to do anymore. Like I literally went from feeling like he was getting better and because we took him to the doctor and he got his like cough medication because he's coughing and like i think his chest is a bit what do you call it it's for us like see sit dry literally his chest is dry and i tried to get him medicate i took him to the doctor and then we got medication what they gave us was you know the normal cough syrups but for babies I forgot what the name of it was but then they gave us two um two different syrups and then the other one was um what's the pink thing the um, the pink one not cowpaw allergics so they gave us allergics as well so i've been using that on him um the last time he went to the doctor was almost two weeks ago i think 
but oh, definitely over a week ago he went we went to the doctor again. and then okay, he was starting to get better well i thought he was starting to get better okay my ring light is on because it's late right now it's almost dark outside it actually is dark outside it's past six i think yeah it's past six um in the evening and i am busy cooking but yeah i hope he does get better I, I got him more medication from the pharmacy i got him um because it looks like he's got a lot of it's called in flame is that what they call it i feel like yeah he's got a lot of flame that's stuck somewhere between his chest and his like throat and nose so we're trying to get that out and then one of the ladies i work with actually advised me to try and heat up some cooking oil give him one teaspoon of that obviously not while it's hot like let it warm up let it um cool up a bit and then give that to him and then with a little like a little bit of lemon juice with that so i tried that yesterday and it actually did work shame guys i'd be lying if i said that it didn't it worked because um some of the flame actually got out but not not all of it yet because he was still struggling to to breathe well like last night so it, that actually kept me up so i'm actually a zombie right now i went to work just tired and exhausted because i can't sleep if my son's not feeling well like i just can't do that um but yeah lips are dry but yeah so last night that was the story and then i gave him that allergics and the other medication and then he wasn't better this morning he was breathing a lot better but like he was still coughing and his chest was still dry and then for some reason it's like his voice is gone or is going away i don't know it's just freaking me out because usually when he's sick or has a cold or a flu or whatever it was just like a few days then he's fine and this time it's really freaking me out although they're saying that it's normal for babies when they're teething because he's getting new teeth and stuff I, th I think i explained that um the other day so okay sana i'm just so locked stressed out um but still trying to take it easy um my main priority is just taking care of him i don't care if i don't get enough sleep or whatever the case may be like i'm sure he's gonna start sleeping through the night and that means i'll get to sleep through the night but yeah that's what's happening i want to show you guys what i got for him from the pharmacy not the pharmacy i got it's not from the pharmacy I actually check her 60 this while I was at work. I hope my boss doesn't watch my videos because check her 16 stuff at work is just not allowed. So I got him this um, nasal spray or like nasal hygiene is what they call it specifically for babies. And it says it's the Sterima nasal hygiene for baby gently cleanses. It says sea water water nasal spray so i got him that and then yeah just for his nostrils maybe to just kind of moist what do you call moisturize them a bit because i feel like his nostrils are also dry and then hopefully that gets to his chest and that does the work that it needs to do and then someone recommended this which is um it is a do i call it a syrup for bony bony what so it's called Bonnie Sand. I don't know how it's pronounced, but someone recommended this to me on Facebook. And it's a woman that we go to church with and she has had, I think, two babies, if I'm not mistaken, because I was complaining about my baby not sleeping through the night. And then she actually recommended this. It says for infants up to, um, so for infants, and then also for, so it's half a teaspoon for infants. And then one month to six months, half, it's one teaspoon full six months to three years which is my son that would be two teaspoons full three times daily so perfect so this is apparently supposed to help him with his sleeping and then if he has any like indigestion problems or digestion problems or like what do you call it constipation whatever the case may be this also does the work i read it somewhere I find that so yeah it improves appetite so if there's lots of appetite especially my son now well he's sick he still eats but he's definitely lost quite a lot of appetite it promotes weight gain oh guys my child is already weight gain on his own <laughs> ha! 
and healthy growth and keeps babies free from digestive upsets gas colic gripes diarrhea or constipation which is why i bought this because it's like a all-in-one basically so yeah i'm cooking right now i'm just making rice with um a chicken with a chicken bean curry i just made that up <laughs> but it's just chicken so i bought um it's not chicken breast what do you call them and then i bought red kidney beans which i'm going to mix in that and turn it all into a nice lovely curry i'm really feeling for a nice curry with rice rice is my favorite thing chicken is also my favorite thing so yeah, that whole thing is just my favorite meal so that's what i'm making tonight and then my husband's going to be a little bit late what's today today is tuesday yeah so he's going to be a little bit late today yeah i just wanted to pop in and say hello um, today is Friday. It's a public holiday. It's Easter weekend. So I am home with my family, with my husband and my son. Um, yeah, because my husband's always busy at work, guys. So today is the one day where we just get to chill. The plan was to, I had planned on taking them out like for lunch or something fun to do, but then just because he works so hard, um, he was just so exhausted to even do anything. This job of his is literally taking all of his energy, and I hate it. But they are currently sleeping, they are taking a nap, and I am about to go take a bath. I just wanted to show you guys these bath bombs. This is what they call them. They call them bath bombs. I well, I had never heard of this before um, until it was gifted to me by my colleagues on my birthday. It's called bath bombs, and it says you have a bomb, sugar rush. This is the sugar rush one, and it says pretty pomegranate. Pretty pomegranate. So I'm going to try these for my bath because I haven't taken a bath today. I just wanted to really try this and see how it works. So apparently what you do is you just throw them in your bath and I don't know if it creates color or what it does. It doesn't really say here, but obviously I asked my colleagues when they got it from me, I was like, oh, I've never heard of this, so exciting. Like, what is this about? And then they told me all about it. So I'm about to try it out. Um, I'm not gonna take a very long bath though because hubby's still going to work later on. So he also has to take a bath right after me. Um, but there's a pink and a blue one in here. So I think I'm just going to use one. I'll take the pink one for today and see how that goes. And then they also got me um, champagne, which I've already consumed. None of that's left. <laughs> they also got me um, these three face masks. And then I just want to see which one I'm going to be using today. Um, yeah, let us see which one. Which one looks more exciting? Moisture balm. So there are all no two of them. Two of them are Garnier. Two of them are Garnier, and then one of them is Himalaya. Is that how you pronounce it? I'm not sure. I think so. But I think let's go with one of the Garnier ones. So both say moisture balm, super hydrating, blah, blah, blah. Hydro, um, hyaluronic acid. So I'm glad they both have hyaluronic acid because that's good for the skin. And then this pink one has chamomile. Is it chamomile or chamomile? This pink one has chamomile. And then this one um, has pomegranate as well. Okay. So this one is for dehydrated skin, the blue one. And this one is for dry and sensitive skin so i'm just going to go with and they're both infused it says both infused with the quality of one bottle of serum so i think i'll just go with this pink one today and let's see how that goes i need to still be able to breathe at home i will like i must still be able to breathe Ooh, at home i look like i look like casper the friendly ghost but i don't look that friendly so i'm just casper not the friendly ghost i'm just casper the ghost not that friendly i don't think this is how it should look it looks so funny and so weird but hopefully it just does the job okay guys please don't laugh now hey i know this probably not even probably i know this looks funny 
but just don't laugh okay it's good it's good for my skin okay <laughs> it feels like i have botox at home you but now what happens here because i don't think i can breathe properly i'm just gonna do this guys i don't know how it's supposed to go but maybe i must pull this up a little bit oh yeah that looks so much better mm, period so i'm supposed to keep this on for 15 minutes but i don't have a lot of time so i'll probably make it like 8 to 10 minutes and and just hope for the best hope that it does the job that it's supposed to do um and then i'm gonna put the rest away so next time i'll go with this blue one and then next time i'll go with this in the and then i'm gonna show you guys how this bath bomb look uh, this bath bomb looks so i said i was going for the pink one today right um but i feel like i'm doing everything pink no let's do blue let's do the blue bath bomb because i went for this pink mask right so let's do the blue bath bomb i'm going to show you guys I've, i had never heard of this before it was it will be my first time using this so let's just hope that it does hopefully i like it um i hope it smells good too i think it's supposed to smell good it has sodium bicarbonate citric acid blah 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 seed oil okay seed oil is good castor oil so good perfume so it does have fragrance okay perfect
my skin is just so dry you can tell winter's very close but yeah it's a saturday today and the date is yeah it's saturday the 13th of april um it is my niece's birthday it's my niece's birthday guys i can't believe she's like what i don't even know how old she is today i think she's like she should be nine or ten yeah but i can't believe how grown she is just now she was a baby and it feels like wow time actually really flies but happy birthday to my baby girl auntie loves you so much so there's no sun coming in here right now i think that's why i'm really struggling with the lighting so the lighting is fine but i just need the sun to come this side and it's just not doing what it's supposed to be doing but anyway i will be closing off this vlog today you guys before i do that though i do want to just show you guys um my sheen delivery i got a sheen delivery but this time i got nothing for myself everything i got was for my son that's what happens when you're a mom guys it's like your whole life just revolves around your kid or like your kids um but yeah so yeah you guys i really was just saying that i just want to take this moment and just really like i just feel so grateful this morning um just for a lot of things um some of which i won't be mentioning to you guys right now but i'm just so grateful i feel like god has been showing up for us and just really doing the most i know god has always been there and god is always showing up but i just feel like this year in particular like i just i feel his presence and i really see what he's doing for us and there's nothing as like satisfying yeah i was saying like there's nothing as beautiful as you as seeing your, your prayers getting answered and i just feel like god has been doing the most um you guys saw that we bought our first car together this year and this is very special it's like both of us getting our first car together because it's his first car but it's also my first car and it's like god was just he had this planned out i feel like god really had this planned out and he was like okay so i'm gonna do this for you guys and like it's just really beautiful to see that most of the things that we're praying for like this was one of the things that we prayed for getting a car just to make life easier um for us in general we're so grateful for that and we see god god's presence in our lives every single day and there's just a lot more like that just has been happening from the small things like it just it doesn't have to be big things all the time that are happening in your life in order for you to see that god is just there and doing the most it's just small things as well like you know last year in december no it was actually this year in january i went for my supplementary exams there was like two modules which that which i didn't pass so then i went for i didn't pass the exams for them so i went to write my supplementary exams which killed me by the way um so yeah i wasn't feeling very motivated after that because i was like you know what i'm probably just not gonna get to where i need to get in terms of like my education and my career because this is just not happening and when i got out of that exam room both times i felt very just demotivated like i don't want to do this anymore this is still killing me like i gave it my all i studied i did this i did that and like i still don't feel like i didn't even finish half the paper for one of those exams i didn't think i don't know if it was half or just like the last two questions that i didn't finish which was costing a lot of marks which was worth a lot of marks by the way so i was feeling very demotivated after that and i was like you know what at this point i know i gave it my all what I ha whatever happens happens but i'm very demotivated and i don't see myself pursuing this career in accounting anymore if this is what it's going to do to me it's just like stress me out all the time only to find out that i actually passed both those modules i don't know how guys to this day i literally was telling my sister the other day i was like i don't know how this happened i don't know how i passed those modules because that wasn't me i can tell you guys that was not me because i know what i wrote and i I don't know guys I don't know but I was just not feeling any of those two exams after writing them and that's just how I knew this is God like this is not me it just has to be God and so that's what I'm saying like it's the big things and it's the small things super grateful for our car super grateful just for everything that God's been doing for us and I know that there's a lot more on the way so I'm already grateful for that as well <laughs> we are really grateful for that as well um, yeah so 
I'm gonna close this vlog off, but before I do that, I wanted to show you guys the Sheen delivery that we got. My colleagues and I actually placed this really huge bulk Sheen order sometime. I think it was like two weeks back, right? So we're like, okay guys, it's payday. Let's just place this huge order. Whoever wants to place an order, just send through your orders. So we sent, we sent all our orders to this one person. So like send whatever you want to buy. So you just send the link to this one person. That person placed the order for us, paid for everything. And then obviously told us what we needed to transfer to her. And then it was just this big box that arrived yesterday at work. Yesterday was what, Friday, ne? Yeah, we got the delivery only, yes, only yesterday. And yeah, so exciting. I got nothing for myself this time though. Everything I got is from my son. So I'm just gonna show you guys that quickly before I close this vlog. Or, so I didn't get many things. Okay, I thought that was my son because he's sleeping. He's supposed to be sleeping. So I didn't get that many things actually. It's just four pack cards. Just these four packs that I got because winter is actually quite close. So I figured I needed to add on to the things that I got. I already got him like socks. I got him a few jerseys and like two jackets, I think. So I just needed to add these on to just to make sure that he has everything that he needs for winter and then month end i'll be placing an order for myself this time and then a few things for my husband as well he's actually here today but he is outside right now and my son is sleeping so i decided to just do this right now before before ulandile wakes up and before he gets here because once those two are in my space guys it's very hard to vlog or it's very hard to just make videos because they just are i literally have two sons like that's all i can say i've got hey i have two sons guys but she has the cutest things like for kids well she in general has the cutest thing so the first package is this and then this is a two-piece it is a two-piece sort of like track sitting no not really a track suit so it's like pants so this is actually quite big on him right now but because i went for size 18 to 24 months for everything uh, that i got for him because i i just wanted i didn't want to get stuff that would get small on him too quickly stuff that he would outgrow too quickly so this i'm sure he'll wear until he's like two or so right now he's only a one year and one month and this is 18 to 24 months and he is only like 13 months now but um i'll try it on him and if it doesn't fit then he can keep it till it does also cool and i that's what our parents used to say to us all the time but home. so yeah the first thing i got is this two piece so cute and then this is just plain black right 18 to 24 months and then guys my neighbors all the time i'm so sorry about that i know it's probably loud right now but um let's try not to focus on that okay so but that's really loud though like how do you do that and then what they do is they also open the door so that the whole world must hear what they're listening to we don't want to listen to that but yeah how cute how cute is this you guys okay i think i'm gonna go do this in the other room okay guys the lighting is really bad from the other room so i'm just gonna do this and finish it here quickly but it's just too loud sorry the noise is coming from next door they just listen to music and they have the door open to move out of this place we really need to move. but this is the first outfit so that goes with this and i think this was like 100 and something most of the things i got are two pieces and it's like 100 and something per two piece so this is size but okay. so obviously the package says she in kids the normal one just says she in there's also a new range guys from the women's side it's called she in mod like mod so she in mod and it has the most beautiful things that range in general i think it's just um based on a lot of like vintage stuff from back then that they brought back and just made it look like a lot modern it's such a beautiful range and i think that's where i'm going to get my stuff from month end like it has the most beautiful dresses which i saw on a lot of influencers as well but we'll talk about that some other time i'll show you guys when i when i do order that and get it this is the second i just love the color it is gorgeous also size 18 to 24 man but yeah it's also going to help him in the winter when he has to go to daycare you know how cold it is in the mornings especially so yeah this is the second outfit once again oh look what i got for you baby look what i got for you baby this is the cutest thing i fell in love with this as soon as i saw it guys how cute is this i can't wait to try this on him ah. But I think this was, if not 60 bucks, 80 rand. But I do know it was less than 100 rand. So this is the other thing. Imagine this with this outfit. 
He's going to rock it. He's gonna rock it. Another two piece. This is like my favorite one, guys. So this is denim over here. And then just plain gray on the sides. Also a hoodie, also size 18 to 24. And um, plain gray pants, which are also size 18 to 24. This look quite big, by the way. I don't think this is gonna fit on my son right now, but eventually they will, okay? Also, just like I said. But this is the cutest thing, guys. It's, can't wait to take pictures of him in this and videos. I'll show it to you guys. I'll show it to you guys. Probably in my next vlog because this one has to be closed off today. I feel like it's been dragging since March. It's like a month or something now. <laughs> Imagine doing a monthly vlog. This was supposed to be a weekly vlog. It's a monthly vlog now, but that's okay. Okay, so that's that. And then I got these like slippers things for him. Guys, my son hates shoes for some reason. Why is this one white? Okay, I don't know what's happening here, but I got these cute slippers! How cute are these? I'm gonna insert the price over here somewhere, guys, just to show you guys how much this was. But these are like basically just slippers for babies. And I think they, I just thought they were so cute because he hates shoes. He has like two pairs of sneakers that he has now. Since he turned one, I was like, okay, let's get him shoes and see how he feels about them. So right now, he's not really into them. He just wants to walk in his socks, meaning that I have to wash like 10 pairs of socks a day. Um, which I'm not about <laughs> so I got him these um, that he can just gallivant around the house in or like on a really cold day whatever it is he can but this looks so good with this doesn't it and then another one of my favorite this is the last thing right I think this is the last yeah this is the fourth packet okay yeah oh how cute is this guys how cute is this jersey it's a hooded jersey and it's like really soft and fluffy i love how soft it feels i know it's going to feel nice and warm in this and it is like many shades of brown which i really love on him i love this color on him so the colors that i really love on him are like brown blue gray and white oh those are my baby's colors and that's actually the theme of his room but that is all I got for him this time, guys, because he already has some um, winter clothes that I got for uh, for him, which I got from Ackermans. And yeah, so this is just adding on to what he already had for winter, just to make sure that he doesn't suffer, guys. Then I'll get my own stuff at the end of the month. Um, on this month's payday i'll get i'll order stuff from shein for myself because i saw a lot of nice dresses for winter as well like so warm and yeah so i'm going to show you guys i'm going I'm to show you guys once i've ordered the stuff once it's delivered and everything but i do have to close this vlog off today i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching to this point if you watched up until this point i just want to say i'm really grateful for you thank you so much i really appreciate you don't forget to like this video um don't forget to subscribe share share this video with your friends and don't also forget to turn on post notifications post notifications so you can be noticed don't forget to turn on <laughs> don't forget to turn on post notifications so you can be notified every time i post a new video for now i will see you all in my new video i have to make breakfast for my family so ciao